that's how I talk right there. Uh, I'm Adam Hunter. I'm a local, local voice actor here in Calgary. Um, generally, people know me from Flame of Recca, which is a show where I play the character Gilmo, which is actually a really sweet show that I own on DVD. Uh, we also did a little bit of uh, Dragon Ball and Dragon Ball GT. In Dragon Ball GT, I played Baby, who kind of screwed everything up to people for a while. And uh, lots and lots of background stuff that you would never catch in. So thanks very much for letting me here. How's everybody doing today? Good? Looking great. My name is Michael Dangerfield, and let's see. Seshomru uh, in Inuyasha. I know there was some complaints about it because I replaced David K. You guys, you know the story? Thank you. Good. Um, Johan Trinity in uh, Gundam Double O. Uh, Transformers, Armada, Energon, and. Uh, Cybertron, thank you. Uh, any any uh, Pony fans out there? Brayburn on uh, My Little Pony, and a few others. Here's Kirby. Thank you. Uh, hi, I'm Kirby Morrow. How you guys all doing? Awesome. Uh, currently on air, I have um, a little show called Ninjago. Where I play 14 year old Cole. He's the black ninja. Uh, it's a Lego Ninja Warrior show. Uh, Lego also did a Star Wars show where I play Anakin Skywalker. And General Grievous. I'm also known as Cyclops from X-Men, Michelangelo from Ninja Turtles, Goku, Dragon Ball Z, Moroku, Troll Barton, Von Fennel, uh, Ron Moe and Half. I did some Piccolo Shadan and uh, Dr. Tofu. Um, I think there's more, but anyway, that's me. Hi. Hi, everybody. My name's Lucas. Uh, you might know me from such projects as Mega Man X. You're a fan. Is anybody a fan of Zero? Yes. <laughs> well, I'm a fan of Zero, okay? Uh, I'm also Morikawa in Cardfight Vanguard. So, thank you. Okay, we have a few. There's a Vanguard tournament coming up later on today, so please come out and play if you got your deck. Don't play Yu-Gi-Oh! anymore, that's old news. <laughs> it is, it's old news, guys. You're living in the past. Please move on, okay? Uh, I'm also Gamma, you know? He's a floating yellow ball, so just respect that. Okay? Thanks, guys. Hello. Uh, I'm Carol Ann. Uh, I'm also a voice actor from here in the city. Um, I've been in uh, a lot of projects over the last uh, 12 years or so. Um, I, uh, Dragon Ball, I was uh, Chi Chi in that. <laughs> and uh, also Misaki in Card Fight Vanguard, a uh, series from uh, My Hime, uh, Zeta Gundam, G Gundam, I was Alan B in 4. Reverse those, just get the two shows mixed up. Um, but yeah, uh, excited to be here. Uh, hi, my name is Scott Roberts. I'm a local voice actor as well. I've done basically all the same projects you guys have done. Yeah. You too. Uh, I was Rekka in Flame of Rekka. I play Shin in Vanguard. Yay! You, you're awesome, dude. That's, I just, uh, that's His name's Tyler. Tyler's really, really cool, guys. Awesome. We like Tyler. Um, yeah, so a lot of the same projects. We all work at the same studio. Um, Dragon Ball, G Gundam, all that kind of stuff. And I'm also really happy to be here. Thanks. Out of all of you here, who knew that you had a studio in your own city that dubbed? Aside from Tyler. Aside from Tyler. You don't count anymore. You don't get it. But you guys knew. Okay, that's great. That's awesome. You don't even live here. Where are you from? Grand Prairie. Grand Prairie. Okay, you're welcome. We're sorry. <laughs> that's cool. All right, so does anybody have any questions? If you have a question, put your hand up right now. All right, thanks for coming. All right, we're done. Okay, good night. Jin at the den in five. Oh, okay. Okay, I'll start off with a couple questions. Do you guys have any questions? Just as soon as somebody stops. Okay. Well, one right there from Tyler. I think. Is there a mic for them? Yeah. Well, they can. Yeah, no, they can show. Yeah, yeah, we can have a car fight for sure. You know that I'm gonna kick your ass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm actually really bad at it. For those of you that know card games, I, I don't even know how to draw. I don't know how to count my cards. I can't even shuffle, so. <laughs> but yeah, for sure. Later on today, we can do that. Yeah. I actually have to explain to the director how the game works. Really? Yeah. Because uh, I'm also a, a card gaming nerd. I usually play Magic the Gathering, but I play Goki on uh, Cardfight Vanguard. And. Uh, 
Oh, thank you, yeah. They had no idea how to play the game, though it was hilarious. I was like, so you understand what the trigger check is, right? So right now, I just broke it all down for me, like, what is wrong with you? <laughs> Quit being that way. And I was like, come on, card game. Yeah, right? I mean, you know, it, all, it all boils down. Who else, uh, who else wants to play some card fight Vanguard up here? Do we have any other takers? Carol Ann? Does anybody have a Grand Blue deck? I'll totally play that. No, no. I have a Blue deck. Oracle Blue deck. That's cute. That's cute. We're... Yeah, Kirby can play Go Fish. Go Fish, yeah! Okay, do we have any aspiring voice actors in the crowd? Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, <laughs> guys, starting from this end, uh, maybe one or two pieces of advice you'd recommend for aspiring voice actors, uh, besides just run. Because uh, that one's been covered every year. Absolutely, no, I mean, what he's saying is that it's hard to make a living at it, but making a living at it is the most fun you can just get paid to do work, right? Uh, I remember when I first got into it, my audition was, I literally walked in uh, with my brother, who's not here right now, uh, and the day when he came home to tell me that he had a, a cartoon and anime audition, I was playing PlayStation in my underwear. I had nothing going on that day. <laughs> it, was, it was really a big change for me, but my real, my real recommendation is if you ever go in for an audition, throw everything into it. Just go in, don't hold back. What they want to know is what you can do. All right, not what you can hold back and not do. So, when they ask you for a big reaction, uh, I personally yelled out, Jesus Christ! And apparently that was not the reaction they were going for. They were looking for a, ah! and that was it, right? So, but I showed them that I was willing to go the extra mile on it, and they really, uh, that, that's what they were looking for at the time. Gonna be lots of doobie rolling in a van down by the river. Uh, got somebody else here now. Ladies and gentlemen, Brendan Hunter has arrived. My sincere apologies, everyone. Thanks so much for uh, allowing me to still participate. He's got two kids. You're making some assumptions, man. <laughs> Do you want him to give us a quick little... Yeah, little I was going to say, uh, why don't you tell us what your name is, Brendan, and, uh, <laughs> and what you've been well, in. Well, Tyler, my name is Brendan Hunter. And what do I do? What you've been in. Yeah. Oh, what I've been in. Uh, I did the Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball GT, uh, Cardfight Vanguard, I did uh, Hisokai and Hunter Hunter, I did uh, Elect Man and Mega Man Powered Up. Um, geez, I should look at my resume. <laughs> well, I, w I was Oob, the uh, reincarnation of Majin Buu, and then I was Tien in uh, Dragon Ball. And, uh, well, I'm, I'm Dr. O. O, 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 in uh, Cardfight Vanguard, which is super fun. And,. Oh, uh, one of everyone's favorite shows, Dice. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> that was on YTV. Well, it, it's, it's a favorite because I was actually able to show my little daughter that I was in something. That's always helpful when YTV picks them up. Um, and oh, that Pretty Cure was on that as well, wasn't it? So I was, I was a big muscular bad guy. I don't get those roles very much anymore. I'm, I'm, I'm the effeminate typecast guy now. I get everything that. You just can't tell, you know? <laughs> so, typecast is cast, kids. Keep that in mind. Um, so, back to the, uh, the pointers. So, uh, so who's uh, inspiring? Voice actors? Very good, very good. So, uh, you gotta buy lots of liquor for people. <laughs> and chocolate works well. No, um, honestly, you have to be good. You're like, it, that's the bottom line. You, you have to be really good to be hired as a professional. They're not going to hire somebody that's just kind of halfway there. So you got to get good training and learn from people that know what they're talking about and have been in the business. And, and then once you, you're ready to launch into the business, you have to have a great demo. So people that are from studios and casting and agents that are going to hear you are going to be impressed, not just have like a lukewarm response to you. So there you go. I have this one. Um, like many businesses, jobs, uh, when you want to excel. Voice acting is all about being sleeping right now. <laughs> Just kidding. Uh, the girl is sleeping in shock. It's, it's, it's called voice acting. So you really got to focus on the acting. Um, if you've never taken any kind of training or in acting, that's a really good start. Uh, and then you worry about your voices later, because they, they just start to come. As you see a character and you see them acting crazy, you can look at a picture and think, oh, they ain't gonna have this kind of a voice. Oh, they'll be a bit crazy. Yeah, you know, you'll start to develop your voice over time, but the acting is the thing you gotta start, start working on from the beginning. That's what I say. All right. Yeah. 
And these, these guys are really, really, on stage here, we have a lot of pros, so listen to them, because I, when I started out, I didn't have anyone to tell me anything. So I went in and just stumbled my way through everything until finally I started getting roles. So I think what I would add to what everyone's saying is, is tenacity. Stick with it. If you want to do it, don't be the kind of person who just drops out and, uh, and stops doing it, because nine out of 10 people stop, and that's why they get nothing. Right? So if you're that one person who just keeps on going, keeps on being smart, keeps on learning, you can be the one person uh, left standing at the end of the day. That's all there is to it. Or be a pretty girl. Yeah, that's and really helpful in anime. And, and like, like Kirby said, it's who you sleep with. So I, 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 I yeah, yeah. And if I had known you just had to sleep with Caroline Day to get a role on anime, uh -huh. I would have taken this off. <laughs> oh. Let's all just, this is going to turn into an orgy really quick, so let's just, let's move on. Let's move on.